Hey guys, I'm Saeed and today I'm gonna show you top 5 things to do after installing GimCal Linux 2016 or any other version. So let's start. So first of all, make sure you are up to date. Types apt get update and and apt get update and and apt get dist update so number two change your dock position and so first of all um, go to extension here you can uh, select intelligent auto intelligent auto hide You can also move your dog to the left, right, or up or down. So, number three, install Google Chrome. So, first of all, download Google Chrome. You can download it by searching uh, Google Chrome. Go to Google website, there will be a link in the description below. So, you can download it, then accept, then select save file and OK. So after downloading open connected folder, here is my downloaded file. You go, now open terminal, then types apt get install f and then select type y then enter. Now type ls for list so you can see your all file desktop file. Uh, now enter desktop by typing cd desktop then type ls for list and copy your file name then type dpkg space then i then space then paste your um, copied file name then enter so that's it now you can open it for by searching here search chrome oops it's not working it's not working because i am a root user if you are also a root user you have to do something more here so you have to copy this so now we have to open uh, terminal then copy user add m chrome user then paste it here then enter then after that uh, to run google copy this uh, gksu and paste it here then enter you'll find this command in the description uh, below so don't worry then select close after that uh, your google chrome browser will open so now you can use uh, google chrome uh, google chrome is um, one of most popular browser in the world but sometimes people say it's uh, not secure as much as um, mozilla firefox so we'll show you how to install mozilla and so now choose default application you can uh, choose it from uh, settings and go to detail then default application here you can uh, set your default application for web calendar music video photos so number th four install vlc player so for installing vlc player open your terminal then type apt gate install vlc then type enter after that type y and enter after that to get access to it you have to press uh, left right or up or down arrow and uh, select ok then uh, yes and there's the yes again yes again
so for open blc player type vlc oops uh, it's not working so you have to run uh, a command s e d i s you'll find this uh, command in the description below so that's it this is our uh, vlc player so here we go we'll get a problem um, if you are a windows user and uh, you may use uh, game player or other player like this we can uh, go forward uh, by left uh, right arrow and uh, go backward by left left arrow and um, we can uh, up and down uh, increase and decrease our uh, volume by up and down arrow but here we can do this uh, so for doing that you ha we have to um, configure vlc player so for configuring this you have to um, uh, open vlc player you can also open vlc player by searching from here and uh, that's it so for configure this go to tools then preferences i will have an option for your hotkeys and uh, you can enter full screen mode and change it uh, hit enter then assign now i wanna change a very short uh, backward jump and hit left arrow then assign and do the same for very short forward jump then now i wanna um, change now i wanna change uh, hotkeys for volume up down so assign i wanna set uh, up and for volume up and down for volume down just up arrow and down arrow so that's it then, um, our customization is complete now if we start vlc player we can uh, use up and down keys for uh, increase and decrease volume so number five remove eyes will browser and install firefox just copy sudo applicate remove eyes will then copy it and paste it here then enter you have this command in the description of the video so don't worry check out my youtube video description so you'll find it and then after that copy applicate update and enter and Every gate is still Firefox, then enter. So that's it. Everything is complete. Now you can open uh, Mozilla Firefox. So that's it for today thank you guys thank you for watching if you got any kind of question or problem you can leave a comment here i'll try to answer you